Oh, you're a do-it-yourselfer and you try to take good care of the cooling system on your car. Well, it's really easy today to make some mistakes in doing that. First, always make sure that the coolant that you buy for your car matches the requirements in your owner's manual. See, one size may fit your car, may fit most cars, but one size usually doesn't fit all cars. So you look at the label on the back of the container to make sure that it has the proper specifications as outlined in your owner's manual. All right, that's number one, proper coolant. Number two, always mix it with distilled water. And the way you do that is before you pour anything back into the cooling system or put it in at any time, you mix coolant and distilled water 50-50, then you put the mix in. All right, so that part of it is pretty easy. Now, a lot of you seem to think that if a little bit of coolant or antifreeze is good, then a whole lot is better. Namely, you don't put any water in it, you just put pure antifreeze in your radiator. Well, here we have pure antifreeze. It has a bolt in it. The bolt is all rusty. But look what happens. Over here, we mixed it 50-50 with distilled water, and the bolt is still shiny and bright. You have to have the water mixed with the antifreeze or coolant, whatever you want to call it, to make it work properly. Now here's one that'll really cost you. Sooner or later, you're going to put new hoses on your cooling system. And when you do that, you take the original equipment clamps off and you throw them away. And you go out and you buy these worm drive clamps. Well, don't do it. You see, worm drive clamps, when you tighten them down, there's a pressure point right under where the uh, screw is in them. And on plastic necked radiators, which is virtually all cars these days, with heating and cooling, over time, it causes the plastic inside the hose to crack, and eventually the hose just falls off because the radiator is destroyed. Save the original clamps or buy replacements from the dealer and use that type of clamp as opposed to the worm drive because it is far, far better for these plastic radiators. And if you have a question or comment, drop me a line right here at MotorWeek.